to Shepard. Enter the password and receive a free gift. Commander Shepard, enter... Please tell me your password, Commander Shepard. Silence is golden. Good to finally meet you, Commander Shepard. Kasumi Goto. I'm a fan. Has Cerberus filled you in on the mission? Honestly, I'm shocked they didn't come to see me sooner. My fault for being hard to find, I guess. What brought you to Cerberus? That's a bit of a story. Short version, they were looking for me, so I trailed them to find out why. Turns out they were looking for someone to join you on an important mission. And we're offering a serious signing bonus. I had a thing I needed help with, so I made them a deal. And here we are. What's with the password and the sneaking around? Are you in trouble or something? I'm the best thief in the business, not the most famous. Need to watch my step to keep it that way. I also needed to make sure all this was legit. And I have no doubts now. You're the real Commander Shepard. Good to have you along, Kasumi. You ready to go? I travel light. I've already slipped my things aboard your ship. I'm really glad you're helping me out with the heist. Can't wait to see how you look in formal wear. What does formal wear have to do with anything? I guess you could go with what you have on, but you'd kind of stick out at a fancy party. I'm looking for my old partner's gray box. A man named Donovan Hawk took it, and I'm planning to get it back. What's this heist you're planning? Not here, Shepard. You'll get a briefing when the time comes. I need time to nail down the details anyway. I've taken the liberty of getting you some evening wear, though. You want to look presentable. What do you know about Donovan Hawk? Mr. Hawk is a well-respected businessman. Arms dealer, murderer, generally not a great guy. His mansion's famous for being hard to crack, but I have a way in, and I think you're gonna love it. I doubt Hawk's the kind of guy who takes kindly to people sneaking into his house. I always expect trouble. That's why you're here. I assume a gray box is some kind of hardware. It's a neural implant. Illegal in most places. Stores memories, thoughts, secret codes, illicit information. This one in particular belonged to my partner, Keiji Okuda. We worked together for a long time, before Hawk killed him. If that's what Cerberus promised you, we'll get it done. It'll be fun. And if we're lucky, you won't even have to draw your gun. We should probably wrap this up. You look pretty silly standing there talking to an advertisement. See you on the ship, Shepard. This recruits is a 20 kilo ferrous slug. Feel the weight! I'm sorry, sir, but I'll need you to remove... This recruits is a 20 kilo ferrous slug. Feel the weight! Every five seconds, the main gun of an Empress-class dreadnought accelerates one to... Obviously, security has tightened since you were last here. Shut it down. What? Do you seriously think? Yeah, okay. Sorry for the inconvenience, ma'am. Our scanners are picking up false readings. They seem to think you're... Uh, dead. I'm getting that everywhere. It's a pain in the ass. Who do I talk to about it? Our station commander is just beyond the scanners. Out and to the right. He can reinstate your IDs. You'll have... Yes? I see the problem already, Commander Shepard. My consul says you're dead. Your sergeant said you could help with that. Usually you'd have to go through the station security administration to reactivate your IDs, then to customs and immigration to regain access to the Citadel itself, and probably a stop by the Treasury. Spending a year dead is a popular tax dodge. But I can see you're a busy woman. So how about I just press this button right here? And we call it done. 
That'd be great. Done. You're good to go. You should head up to the Presidium, though. The Council would probably like to know that one of their lost specters is still kicking. They didn't make much effort to confirm my death. I'll make about as much effort to tell them I'm alive. Fair enough. But if you have any friends in the Presidium Tower, they might want to know you're all right. I heard you and Admiral Anderson used to be pretty tight. Anyway, something else you need? Or can I get back to work? I should be going. You need anything else? Let me know. C-Sec won't let me. They say I'm a risk. Shepard! Welcome back to the ranks of the living. I wasn't sure you got my message. It's been a long time, Captain. It's Admiral now. They made me Udina's chief advisor and promoted me. I'm glad you came. Though I was hoping the Council would be here for this meeting, too. I spoke to Udina. He never listens to me. Ever since he got the seat on the Council, he thinks the star shine out of his ass. They need someone like you on the Council to get things done. I'm not sure I have the stomach to wade through all the political bullshit around here, Shepard. Couldn't do much worse than Udina, though. All he seems to care about is public relations with the rest of the Council. He doesn't want to deal with the real issues. They need someone like you on the council to get things done. I'm not sure I have the stomach to wade through all the political bullshit around here, Shepard. Couldn't do much worse than Udina, though. All he seems to care about is public relations with the rest of the council. He doesn't want to deal with the real issues. <laughs> what did you expect? I don't know. But he should listen to me once in a while. An advisor isn't much use if you ignore everything he says. They need someone like you on the council to get things done. I'm not sure I have the... Couldn't do much worse than Udina, though. I'm still not clear on why you wanted me to come. There's been a lot of talk since you came back. Some of what I hear has been, frankly, a little disturbing. I wanted to give you a chance to explain your actions. Maybe get the Council to see things from your point of view. But they refuse to see you. You let the previous Council die during Sovereign's attack on the Citadel. They feel you'll always put human interests before galactic concerns. Rumors that you're working with Cerberus haven't helped. What are you doing out there? What did you expect? You left me for dead. Turned your back on me just like you've done to our missing colonists. We thought you were dead. As soon as I heard different, I sent you that message. I know you, Shepard. I know you wouldn't work for Cerberus without a good reason. Something more is going on here. The Collectors are abducting our colonists in the Terminus systems, and I think they're working for the Reapers. The Collectors? We hadn't considered that. There's so little data. They've always seemed like a fringe threat. If they're a front for the Reapers, this is big. But even that may not be enough to get the Council off its tail. Udina and the others have spent the past two years convincing themselves the Reapers don't exist. I tried to get the truth out, but they don't want to see it. It's just easier for them to accept Sovereign as a Geth warship. Are they blind? What about Vigil, the Prothean VI on Ilos? The VI on Ilos shut itself down. You're the only one who spoke to it, just like you and your crew are the only ones who spoke directly to Sovereign. Officially, the existence of the Reapers has been dismissed as a myth spread by Saren to convince the Geth to follow him. We both know the truth. But I've spent two years fighting that line. 
and I don't have much to show for it. The original council was made up of a bunch of blind, stubborn morons. The new council looks just as bad. It's up to you to stop the Reaper, Shepard. All I can do is try to run interference. I'll keep the council and the alliance off your back. Shouldn't be too hard if you're operating out in the terminus systems. Anderson, we need to talk about... Shepard, what are you doing here? Stop by to see how Anderson was doing. Somehow, I doubt that's the extent of it. I'll have to make sure to speak with the rest of the Council and let them know I had nothing to do with you coming here. You know they refused to meet with the Commander? And you know they have good reason. There could be serious political ramifications. Anderson, I expect to see you in my office when you're done here. What an ass. I didn't mean to get you into trouble. Don't worry about it. Once Udina cools off, he'll realize he has to keep me around. Besides, there aren't any official records that you and I spoke, and Udina will want to make sure it stays that way. If I get fired, people will ask questions. So he'll keep me on and just sweep this whole mess under the rug. How've the last couple years treated you? Working for Udina isn't how I plan to spend my twilight years. Sometimes it feels like I'm just beating my head against a wall. Knowing the truth about Sovereign is brutal. It's nightmare stuff. I can't blame others for not wanting to believe it. But I know how important it is. So I keep trying. Fighting the good fight, right? How long did it take to get this place back up to speed after the battle? Still counting. The main areas of commerce and the most populated wards are complete. But estimates for total restoration are sitting around five years. The Keepers always surprise us, though. It's like our repairs are annoying. We'll put up an ugly new bulkhead, and in a few days, they've made it seamless. We never really thought of them as heavy lifters, and I have no idea where they get the resources. But we'd never get done without them. I'm surprised no one can tell Sovereign isn't Geth technology. Didn't they examine the wreckage? We don't have much to look at. Pieces of it rained all over the station. It was chaos, with who knows how many species combing the wards for their dead. We secured as much of it as we could. But between the Keepers and a whole lot of unauthorized salvage, there's no way to account for even half of that thing. Another reason why they don't want to acknowledge what Sovereign was. What happened to Staff Lieutenant Olenko after the Normandy was destroyed? Staff Commander Olenko is still with the Alliance. But he's working on a special mission. It's classified. I can't say any more. Not while you're working with Cerberus, I'm sorry. How have the last couple years treated you? Working for Udina isn't knowing the truth, but I know how important it is. So I keep trying. Fighting the good fight, right? Forget Udina and the Council. Join my crew and help me stop the Collectors. I'm too old to go racing across the galaxy. Much as I complain, I've got an important job to do here. The front line, that's got to be yours. Last I knew, we were still fighting holdouts. They're here and there. But they are increasingly disorganized. It's long since stopped being called a war. More like cleanup. Not that you can ever discount them. But we haven't had serious casualties for months. A civilian ship will spot an enclave and we send in a squad to clear it. They're not quite the boogeyman they used to be. I better go. Of course, Shepard, I understand. I wish I could do more to help you, but if you ever want to talk, I'll be here. Just do me a favor and be careful. You can't trust Cerberus. Something I can do for you, Shepard? I better go. My door is always open. Two years since the destruction of the Destiny Ascension, planning... Welcome back, Shepard. It has been two years, three months, and 17 days since the Citadel last greeted you. 
The Zakara Ward Marketplace provides shopping and storage space for the less privileged residents of the station. This area looks a little run down. I take it the people here aren't very well off? Inhabitants of the wards typically have less income than those in the Presidium. There must be some way to solve the problem. Asari futurists believe poverty cannot be eliminated without cornucopia technology, which will create anything the user desires. Such technology is unknown outside of science fiction literature. And here I thought the Citadel was some sort of utopia. The recorded histories of all sapient species suggest that in every society, resources are not evenly split between members. What sort of things are sold here? The Serta Foundation, a medical technology group from the Alliance, has an outlet store. Sarinus Applications offers professional software. Why are there warehouses in the middle of a shopping district? This area is close to Zakara Ward's keel docking station. Freighters attach there to load passengers and supplies. Goods are stored locally until they can be distributed within the ward or transported off the station. However, CSEC recommends that visitors exercise caution, as these short-term warehouses are often used to move illegal goods. That's all for now. Thank you for using Avena. Have a pleasant day. A source reports that the attack on the human colony of Freedom's Progress is being investigated as a possible terrorist attack. Welcome to Sarinus Applications. Can I interest you? Ah, Shepard! Do I know you? No, but I know you. Even a senile Hanar would remember the human who fought off the Geth. I thought you were dead. Yeah, I've been getting that a lot. Please, look around the store. It's a pleasure to have you here. You know, I use quite a bit of software in my line of work. It's a shame so few understand their own equipment. Besides the most obvious point-and-go nav interfaces, anyway. You wouldn't believe how often I hear, Why is the ship turning around? We're only halfway there. <laughs> oh, I would. You know, I like your products. Any interest in an endorsement from the human who defeated Saren? I'd be thrilled. But I don't think I could afford to pay you for it. Don't worry about it. What if we just work out a discount? Absolutely. Just speak into my console here. I'm Commander Shepard, and this is my favorite store in the Citadel. That will be splendid. I can edit that and have it working right away. Thank you so much. I'll take it. What do you think, Michael? Good day, citizen. Welcome to the Serta Foundation outlet on Zakara Ward. I couldn't help but notice your prices. They seem a bit steep. With respect. The Foundation is not concerned with profits. A portion of our sales funds research to cure genetic diseases. You know, it would make your services more popular. An endorsement from the woman who defeated Saren. Oh my! You're Shepard, aren't you? I would be glad to give you my employee discount if you would do that for us. It's a deal. Just speak into my console here. I'm Commander Shepard, and this is my favorite store on the Citadel. I'll work it into our advertising at once. Thank you. We can use this. The nerve enhancements say that there are occasional motor control side effects. Jake loves to run. What if it makes him fall down? Jake is fine. Wouldn't a refund? Just got a refund in exchange, and I was told to pick up a new Omni Jail converter here. I don't think this Clanthus is a thief, and I want. Get a shimas! Greetings, Earth Clan. You will find many excellent ships for sale here. Only slightly used, yes.
I hear this is the best place for food on Zakara Ward. You heard wrong. This is the best place for food on the whole damn citadel. Good day, my friends. Welcome to the Citadel. Since these stores are owned by the Council, do government employees get a discount? Yes, in fact. Uh, what's your position? I'm a former Spectre. My goodness. I didn't know Spectres quit. I don't believe you qualify for a discount, though. How about if I throw in an endorsement from the woman who defeated Saren? You are Shepard? My goodness. The increase in sales would certainly be worth offering a discount. What do you need me to do? Just voice your endorsement into my console. I'm Commander Shepard, and this is my favorite store on the Citadel. Excellent. I will get my clerical VI to add it to our advertising immediately. up there. If I hear an herd knock went up there once. I'm sorry, but I can't let you board the shuttle with that. But this is a ceremonial item of my people. tried Galaxy of Fantasy yet? Uh, I love that game. It's based on Turian mythology. Human? Excuse me. What? Look, I know our races aren't on the best of terms. You are kinslayers. Your Admiral Hackett let the Council die. There's nothing I can do about that. What I can do is stop the Geth from attacking again. You hunt Geth? Geth, pirates, mercenary scum. All over the Terminus. That's dangerous game. I don't like your kind, but I'll help the enemy of my enemy. I'll give you a discount, but I'll deny it if word gets around. Thank you. Just get the hell out of here before I change my mind. Want to hear your story, Shepard? Captain Hannah Shepard has apparently turned down an Admiral Star and will remain in command of the Orizaba. The captain deemed her promotion to Admiral a political ploy and said that she could best honor her child's legacy by. Do you have any games you'd like to trade in? You get two credits toward a new game. This is my favorite store on the Citadel. Fine, fine. I just need to pick up some spices. Amino Dextrous and Amino Sinister, if you have it. You don't mix your spice correctly. What cooking school did you take?
foundation is likely to close by the end of this fiscal year. The foundation never recovered from a deadly attack by biotic extremists on one of its medical centers two years ago. I'm sorry. I'm trying to take a statement here. There's nothing to talk about. She stole my credit shit. Arrest her. I did not! Just because I'm a Quarian! I need you to stop and take a deep breath. You're mocking me, Earth Clan. Just because the Vol Clan need... It was a poor choice of words, sir. I apologize. Do you know who's telling the truth? My Omni tool can tell the Quarian doesn't have a chit on her. But she could have stashed it to recover later. You know what Quarians are like. <laughs> and she's definitely a vagrant. I'll run her in and see what Bailey wants to do with her. You say you're falsely accused? I was walking to the used ship dealer when he barged into me outside the Serta Foundation. He didn't stop or say he was sorry. A minute later, he runs up with C-Sec and accuses me of stealing his damn shit. Do you spend a lot of time with the used ship dealer? Yeah. They've got a lot of nice models. I'd like to buy one and take it back to the fleet, but... A ship would make a great pilgrimage gift. You know about the pilgrimage? I traveled with Quarian, who was on hers. I... Wow. I didn't know anyone here would do that for one of us. I'll see if I can find out what happened. Ma'am, this is a C-Sec matter. We'll do all we... Bah! All we can to resolve this. We don't need civilian help. If you do happen to find the chit, please let one of her officers know. Let's go. Be careful out there. Look, it took me a long time to get this refund. It's a Tipari, now available with dextro amino acids. I'm Commander Shepard. I just... Good day, citizen. Welcome to the Serta Foundation outlet on Zakir Award. Avolus was in here not too long ago. Did he drop a credit chip? And not that I saw. He didn't purchase anything. I'd like to buy something. Purchases are made through our catalog interface. It's over there. If everything's done by catalog, why are you here? Customer service. Returns, exchanges, and group rates. We also find that sales are better when there's someone to personally interact with. Though I'm not sure why a human company exclusively hires a sari to work their stores. Thanks for your time. Come back soon, Shepard. I trust you, Michael. What medical upgrades do you want to get for him? I don't know. Maybe we should ask random people on the street. I'm Commander Shepard, and this is my favorite store in the Citadel. Ah, my favorite customer. What can I get you? A Volus was in here not too long ago. Did he drop a credit chip? Oh, yes. He bought some environmental system drivers, then left without his chip. I didn't notice he'd left until he was already gone. If you see him, tell him I have it here behind the counter. I'd like to buy something. Oh, it's all automated these days. There's a catalog interface over there. Thanks for your time. I'll be here if you need anything. Please move along. You forgot your credit shit at Saranus Applications. The clerk's holding it for you. Oh. Well. The Quarian could have stolen it. I'll close this event report, but I'll be watching you. Get a permanent residence, or I'll run you in for vagrancy. Are you too serious? What? You falsely accused this girl of stealing from you. All you have to say now is that she could have stolen it? Now, just a minute. And you? She gets harassed and insulted by this guy, and you throw in a threat to arrest her for vagrancy. How about if I run you in for obstruction of justice? You think you're gonna run in a former Spectre? I think both of you should get out of here. Oh, son of a... Thank you. I... I wish I could give you something more than words. What the hell was that C-Sec guy's problem? He had no evidence that you did anything wrong. I don't know. Everyone's been like that since I got here.
Got time for the press, Shepard? There. Police have been seen in Al Jalani, Westerland News. I interviewed you two years ago when you first became a Spectre. You presented your case very well on camera. Do you have a minute? What, so you can try to do another smear job on me? Now, Shepard, you may object to my methods, but we're on the same side. Your bat, your news. I just want to give your story its due. Sources claim you were at the heart of the Presidium during the Battle of the Citadel. It's fair to say the course of the battle hinged on your words. If true, you told Admiral Hackett to abandon the Destiny Ascension, sacrificing... I've had mind. enough of your disingenuous assertions. <laughs> I wish I'd done that the first time we met. You bitch! I'll make sure everyone in the Alliance sees that. Check this. Did we get it? Nice. You know what's good? Alliance Corsair. The battles are pretty realistic, but it's still fun. And you can install it on an Omni tool. What will it be? I want the strongest thing you have. Easy enough. This is... it's green. And guaranteed to knock you on your ass. Unless you're Dextro DNA like me. If you are, it'll kill you. Anything else? Hear about anything interesting going on around here? I serve drinks. You wanna know what's going on? Check the news. I don't know why humans always ask me that. Let's have another one. There you are. Anything else? Not done yet. I'm impressed. I've never seen anyone drink three of these. Anything else? Hit me again. How about we mix it up a little? This is genuine Vitarian ale, uncut. Don't ask how I got it. I've been serving here eight years. I've never seen anyone have this and stay on their feet. Anything else? I'm done for now. Let me know if you change your mind. Strongest thing you have. Easy enough. This is. it's green. And guaranteed to not get on you. How about we mix it up? I've been serving here eight years. Okay, for you, something special. This is Krogan liquor, Rincon. You'll set off radiological alarms after you drink it. Should I pour you a quad? Come back later. Good. Go eat some starches and drink some water. We will have a hangover tomorrow. I want the strongest thing you have. Easy enough. This is guaranteed. It. Okay, for you, something special. This is Krogan liquid. Hell yeah. Put more of the stuff in the, the thing more stuff goes in. Your funeral, sister.
be. I want the strongest thing you have. Easy enough. This is... it's green? And guaranteed did not get it. I'm done for now. All right. Looking good, Miss Allison Gunn. Hawk won't be able to keep his eyes off you. Take it I'm wearing this get-up for a reason? You'd look really out of place at a society party in armor, don't you think? You look great. You should wear this stuff more often. Remind me, what kind of man are we dealing with? Hawk's a weapons dealer and smuggler. He killed my partner and stole his gray box. Other than that, he's not so bad. Rich, charismatic. Willing to crack open a man's skull to get at the neural implants inside. I assume Allison Gunn is my cover. You run a small but talented band of mercs out in the Terminus systems. Precisely the type of person Hawk respects. I took the liberty of giving you a reputation. Papers, witnesses, article in Badass Weekly. Just don't start talking business with him, and you'll be fine. Now is probably a good time to fill me in on the details. You have been waiting patiently. Our friend Hawk is throwing a party for his closest friends. A couple dozen of the worst liars, cheaters, and mass murderers you'll ever want to meet. All bringing gifts as a tribute to the man himself. Our tribute is a lovely statue of your old friend Saren, rendered with loving detail and filled to the brim with our weapons and armor. You can keep your pistol as long as it's concealed. They won't hassle you over a sidearm. Once inside, we'll make our way to Hawk's vault door, somewhere in the back of the ballroom. Then, we case the security and start peeling away the layers. The statue should be there, waiting for you to crack it open and arm up. Then we just waltz into the vault and take back KG's gray box. And I'll finally get a chance to say goodbye. What's in the gray box that makes it worth all this trouble? The gray box holds Keiji's memories. Everything from all the codes and plans he stole to... 
all the time we spent together. Wrapped up in those memories is the secret he stole. Keiji never told me what it was, but the information got him killed. This ought to be interesting. That's what I'm going for. This is our stop. After you, Ms. Gan. Hold a moment, ma'am. There seems to be an issue with the statue. Is there a problem, yeah? No, Mr. Hawk. Just doing a scan. I don't believe we've met Donovan Hawk. I've heard a lot about you. Name's Allison Gunn. And though I've heard a lot about you. You've been very busy lately, if the extra net is to be believed. Sir, the scanners aren't picking anything up. Hmm. I don't think our guests would come all the way here from Ilium just to cause trouble. Do you? You may pass through, Miss Gunn. You were invited after all. But I will ask your companion to remain outside. You understand, I hope. No problem. You're the host. Enjoy the party. Well, that didn't go as I expected. Any idea why he'd send you away? No. We've never seen each other in person. And no one knows what I look like. Just watching his ass, I'm sure. I can't blame him. What do we do now? We go on with the plan. You'll just have to do all the talking. I'll stay out of sight and stick with you the best I can. We'll keep radio contact in case something goes wrong. We need to find the door and case the security. We'll figure out the next step then. How did you ever contain that situation on the hull? Oh, that? A quick application of force, a little pressure, and bam, done. Thank goodness. I thought those rabble would dog you for years. your read on that Archangel guy? I hear he's dead. Or gone, or something. Good riddance, I say. Chief Rowe, huh? She sounds like a hot ass. If we could tap into the guards' communications, I could probably use this information. I hear Mr. Hawk's vault is exquisite. Who could know? He never lets anyone near it. <laughs> Say, what's that over there? Hawk's bedroom, I believe. Wow, who's his architect? This is a very impressive place. Or a very large one, at least. Very nice. There's more here than I expected. Password protected voice lock, kinetic barrier, DNA scanner, looks like an EX700 series. Everything a vault needs to be impenetrable. This gonna be a problem? Please, remember who you're talking to. We'll need to get a voice sample for the voice lock. You'll have to go chat up Hawk for that. We'll have to find a password too. DNA? Child's play. We should find plenty of DNA samples in Hawk's private quarters. And the barrier? Cut the power. Never fails. If we can find it. Keiji could get through a system like this in his sleep. And I'm better. Let's get to it. It looks like the barrier's power cable runs under the floor here. I'll set your Omni tool and for electromagnetic fields. 
Mr. Hawk's private rooms are off limits to guests without security clearance. Never mind then. Enjoy the party. Private rooms. We need to get in there. That's the best place to find Hawk's DNA. There he is. All you need to do is keep him talking long enough for me to get a voice print. Pull out the charm on this one, Shep. Whenever you're ready. After you. Miss Gunn, good to see you. That scene at the door hasn't soured your evening, I hope. I understand the security, but who would dare try to break into Donovan Hawk's home? Gunn, in our line of work, we attract a certain element. Few understand the pains we take to keep the barbarians at bay. People these days want comfort, entertainment, love. They don't see that the galaxy is fragile. They only have to worry about simple luxuries. Why? Because people like me and you are doing the terrible things that keep the galaxy spinning. This party is for us. The cleaners. The support structure for the galaxy's gleeful delusions of peace. May there always be a market for the things we do. I said get him talking, and you got him talking. We've got enough of a voice sample. Let him go. Enjoy the party, Miss Gunn. Once we find the password, we can get past the voice scanner. We need the password. Let's look for a security console we can hack for info. Don't touch that. Without Hawk's DNA, you'll set off every alarm in the building. Hawk throws a hell of a party. Yes. I'm not too pleased with the caliber of people he's invited, though. One sec. That should take care of the barrier. Gun. Let me unlock that security room door for you. There we go. Ready when you are. I 
have an idea. See what you can find. Got something? The password is Perugia. Huh. That's the name of the man who stole the Mona Lisa. Nice. I tapped their communications. I think we can get past that private room guard. Tell him Chief Rowe sent you. Now, I just take the voice sample we got from Hawk and... Got it. Now we can crack that voice scatter. Gun. That got it. The barrier's down. Password required. Perusia. Voice ID accepted. Welcome, Mr. Hawk. Hey, no touching. Mr. Hawk's private rooms are off limits to guests without security clearance. I have clearance to go in. On whose authority? I have authorization from Chief Rowe. Okay, one second. Chief Rowe, Samuels. Have you given access authorization to Mr. Hawk's private rooms? They have access, Samuels. Now stop bothering me. Got it. Sorry to bother you, ma'am. Okay, you're clear to go in. Enjoy the party. Look for anything we can get usable DNA from. Just make it quick and quiet. <gasps> Found a sample? No, a credit shit. It's clean. It's a plant. No hair, no skin flakes. The housekeepers must be thorough. Empty. Too bad. A cigarette butt would have been a good source. Not a great saliva sample, but it's still useful. We're going to need more than this for the scanner, though. Hmm. No DNA, but... Looks like Hawk's been trying to crack Keiji's gray box. Looks like he's missing something. He hasn't cracked the encryption yet. Holographic interface. Won't find a sample here. The cleaners don't dare touch treasures like this. We can get some skin cells from the dust. It's probably contaminated, though. We should find another sample. Sorry. We can probably get Hawk's DNA off the data pad. He seems to have obsessed over this. That should do it. Let's get out of here.
He's gone. He's gone. He's gone. He's gone. He's gone. Some say Commander Shepard is still alive. Really? Oh, please. It's wishful thinking, at best. for security cams. Go ahead and get dressed. So this is Hawk's fault. Very nice. This scanner will hone in on the gray box. It's not far. That's a Casa Locus. No, the Casa Locust. The gun that killed two presidents. Gorgeous. It even comes with a perfect copy, too. I'm sure Hawk won't mind if we borrowed these. This might be useful. Oh my god. There it is. Don't bother Miss Goto. It's code locked. I had a feeling that was you at the door. I knew if it was really you, you'd get through anyway. You know me. I don't like to disappoint. I need what's in your grey box, Kasumi. You know I'm willing to kill you for it. I'll admit your skills are impressive. You got into my vault like I'd left it open. But you're still going to die. Scream it. No! Have I got your attention? <laughs> that shut him up. Kill them!
Checking blueprints. There's a landing pad to the east. Let's get out of here. Joker, bring the shuttle in, now! another way. Take heavier weapons than that to blow those tanks. Weapons than that to blow those tanks. Have you been drinking? That got it. Don't let them out of there with my property. Me. 
murderer. Now you see me. What were you shooting? Interesting. Keep them busy. I'll take care of this myself. That's the easy way, Goldberg. Allow me to show you the hard way. Look left. Here they come. <clears throat> Going silent. <clears throat> Can't do that right now. Shot. Here we go.
down. Let's tear that thing apart. On our left. Kasumi, if you're seeing this, it's because I'm dead. The information we found is all here. It's big, Kasumi. If the Council ever got wind of this, the Alliance could be implicated. Kasumi, I... I encrypted the information to keep it safe. And I uploaded the encryption key to your gray box, so no one could get the whole package. But if I'm dead... And if anyone knows about this, then I've made you a target, my love. I'm so... so sorry. Keiji... I know you, Kasumi. You'll want to keep these memories forever. But you don't need some neural implant to know I'll always be with you. Please, Kasumi... Destroy these files. There's nothing more I can do to protect you. I can't do that. This is all that's left. Goodbye, Kasumi. I love you. If it's that important to you, keep it. Just make sure you're ready to live with the consequences. Yeah, I am. I'll stay off the grid. No one will know I exist. I think I want this. Thanks, Shepard. Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. 